the European safety standards are a lot tougher than American standards, and non-stop is the only elevating scaffold approved for use in Europe. To give you an idea of how tough non-stop really is, watch as we simulate a cable failure on a loaded work platform, not once, but four times. Drop the scaffold on uh, so that the safety catch here lands on one of these rungs. We're going to drop the scaffold on rung C. Now, we're going to raise the scaffold so that it, it is above rung B and the safety catch just barely contacts rung A. At this point we have in excess of 3,300 pounds on the scaffold. We have uh, a bin of parts weighing uh, 1,635 pounds and back here on the back we have the bin of uh, steel parts weighing 1,671 pounds. We will have the scaffold supported by this leg with the piece of chain on it. When it's time to drop, we're going to simply pull the leg out. Okay, everything is in position. We're going to perform uh, cycle one of the test now. Go ahead, Jay, pull out. Okay, that's cycle number one. Now we'll check the damage. Okay, as predicted, the safety catch did come to rest on rung C. And the rung the safety catch hit has got pretty significant dent in it, but uh, no appreciable damage really. All right, go, Jay. Go ahead, Jay. Thank you. We have a significant dent in our rung now. However, it has not torn off. When we reset for the fourth drop, the rung has been dropping on has sheared. Uh, the well has held. It's the base metal that has given way. And we're going to see if maybe it'll hold for drop number four. I'm, I'm guessing that it will. Okay, Jay, go ahead. The safety catch functions within its case as it should. There's a little flaking of the paint here where the, where the pounding of the catch has deformed this top piece of metal just slightly. Uh, there are no cracks in the welds. Everything has uh, worked beautifully. Uh, the wrong C that took all the abuse uh, there is uh, the tear on the front surface come down about uh, halfway. It's completely torn from the top. No welds gave loose. It was the base metal that, that sheared loose. Uh, 